one of the traps I found in relationships. I just want to put this out there. Spiritual warfare is real in relationships. And you can do everything right. You done got counseling. Y'all done been fighting for each other. Y'all done been implementing healthy communication. And if you're not careful to be aware of how the enemy attacks y'all, how he keeps trying to creep into y'all stuff, when there's any offense in the relationship, what I'm seeing is this. When two people see it as me versus you versus us versus the problem, we forget we don't wrestle against flesh and blood or in other words we don't wrestle against physical components we only have one enemy and it's the enemy just that everybody's properly equipped this goes into what paul said do not be ignorant to the enemy's devices or his schemes against you and this has nothing to do with not taking accountability for our actions this is the spirits behind the voices the thoughts that we hear when we're offended if you're not careful trying to do it God's way, the enemy will literally show up within your relationships and try to sabotage them. That's why I can confidently say no one's family is perfect. I can confidently say no one's relationship is perfect. Yes, we have natural things that interfere with harmony in relationships, but please let us not be a people that forget we have a spiritual realm and we let the enemy have his field day because he gets to stay uncovered. Let's uncover him now. Address the enemy. Let's come together. It's not me versus you. It's us versus the problem.